Hi, my name is Bob Lukes. I'm the owner of Missoula Brewing Company. My wife and I started it in 2007 to bring back uh, the great history of this beer. A Highlander beer was the beer in western Montana from 1910 to 1964. And as you can see, I'm wearing a baseball uniform. It's because there's baseball history with Highlander. Uh, it was in 1909, and then the Garden City Brewing Company wrote a letter to a baseball team in New York that was called the Highlanders and asked them permission if they could use the name Highlander for their beer. And the response was, sure, because we're going to change our name anyway. And they, of course, became the New York Yankees. And we have Highlander beer in Missoula, starting then in 1910. And it continued till 1964, uh, when the interstate came through and took out the brewery. You see the old picture of the brewery here. It was at the base of Waterworks Hill. And so I moved to Missoula in 1985 and began to learn about the great history of this beer and thought, wouldn't it be great if we could drink Highlander beer again? So I'm primarily a trademark attorney, so I registered all these old brands and then went about partnering with a brewer to bring, bring back this great tradition. And we've hooked up with Great Northern Brewery in Whitefish, Montana to again make Highlander beer. It was released in the summer of 2007. Uh, in 2009, it won the award for Best Montana Beer at the Garden City Brew Fest. And um, it's available in uh, in lots of bars in Western Montana, and of course here at the Rhino. Um, we've had a lot of fun with the beer, and uh, it is brought back as a Scottish red ale. Originally, it was a lighter Western-style lager that was actually patterned after Olympia beer. I've talked to uh, the grandson of the guy that brought the beer back after Prohibition, and that's the story he told me. Uh, but anyway, we wanted to do something Scottish, and so for about two months, I drank nothing but Scottish beer to figure out exactly uh, what we wanted to do and uh, realized that I really love these Scottish red ales. And so I worked with the brewer, uh, Joe Barbaris, at uh, Great Northern Brewery to start with a traditional red Scottish ale and, and then develop it from there. And uh, we came up with a really uh, nice, smooth, uh, malt, roasted malt flavored beer. Uh, it's about 5.0 uh, in alcohol. Uh, a little bit of sweetness and uh, a lot of flavor, uh, and I think you'll you'll really really enjoy it. As you can see, I've got an old uh, beer back here, one of the labels from the 1950s, and so that's how it, it looks like. And now our our 22 ounce bottle, uh, which is available in stores, is uh, is modeled after that and looks very similar. So anyway, uh, we're having a lot of fun with Highlander beer. I hope you enjoy it. Um, we also put on the Celtic Festival here in Missoula, which is the last. Saturday in every July, a great basically celebration of all things Scottish and Irish, lots of, uh, it's all free, uh, fun music, of course we serve Highlander, lots of great Celtic food out there, so come and join us for that, stop into the Rhino and uh, try Highlander yourself if you haven't had it yet, and uh, check out our webpage, uh, highlanderbeer.com, we're on Facebook, and uh, we, we hope you really enjoy the beer. Cheers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>